Yo, yo, yo! This is Sol, also known as SPL Gum, also known as Spatial Gum, also known as Grunt. Your hardest team skull Grunt. And this is Pokemon Masters. Guys, I am going to give you a beginner-friendly version since a lot of you were kind enough to dislike my video for Summer Superstars, Summer Takedown, Round 1, Round 2, Round 3, Round 4. I'm just going to do round 4 and you can replicate this in all the other rounds. But, you know, if you are having a hard time here, you can apply this once in round 4. Then afterward, you can just use skip tickets and, you know, just finish the stage ASAP. So, a lot of you don't probably have Steven or Lyra. We are going to use Price. Price, everyone should have him because Price, I think, if I'm not mistaken, he is obtained in main story. Let me just confirm. Price, yes, chapter 8, you can get Price. And guys, the game actually gives us an easy, easy way to decide who to use because Price is the only one. To have an expanded sync grid aside from the new Steven. So it's only Price that has an expanded sync grid. Other characters don't have expanded. No expanded. No expanded. No expanded. No expanded. So this is the only guy you can power up right now. If you want to copy my sync grid alignment arrangement. Whatever you want to call arrangement. This is how I did it, and my focus was on Hostile Environment 1. For these two, this will trigger on Ice Beam, has a higher percent of freezing the opponent. Aside from that, we have Ice Beam Move Gauge Refresh 3, which makes you be able to move faster. And then the others are just powering up Ice Beam, Ice Beam, Ice Beam. Yeah, that's basically the idea of this Syncrid. And we are also going to use Pikachu. Pikachu for the bonus as well as because Pikachu can have potion. If you want to copy, again, this is my Syncrid. You can pause, you can copy. Focusing on potion, potion, Master Healer 1 and 1. Potion MP Refresh, just in case you need to use it again. 2 Thundershock Hostile Environment 1, so that you can probably paralyze the opponent. And then Paralysis Synergy 5, making your attack stronger if the opponent is paralyzed. So this build is actually for Battle Villa. We're just gonna use that. As for the other character, he, could, he or she could be anyone like anyone at all just anyone for this video i probably will bring out skyla and if you want to see my secret again for skyla it's like this so skyla focuses on take flight mp refresh 3 so that i can use this more than once more than twice rather increases the defense and increases speed of all of us bottom line or bottom potion mp refresh master healer one just similar to pikachu and with that said let's go to the battle guys events Summer Superstars, Summer Takedown Round 4. Again, just copy this in Round 3, Round 2, Round 1. If it works on Part 4, works on everything else. Um, Price on the center. On the right is Pikachu. On the leftmost side is Skyla. And Tactics. Tactics meaning order which you are going to get attacked. My first target was on Skyla. You can switch this around. Second target is Pikachu and third target last to be attacked is Price. As for lucky skills, if you're curious, no lucky skills on Skyla. Best lucky skill for her is Vigilance. 
I have a lucky skill on Pikachu, Fast Track 2, just to increase my speed, can be vigilant as well. And on prize, I don't think I have a lucky skill at all. And if you have ice type um, gears, just equip that. We are, just for this video, I am going to release my gears just to make it like super beginner friendly. No gears. Here we go. Again, um, this actually uses stamina unlike the full force battle. So make sure, you know, you are prepared. <laughs> if you lose, no problem. Your stamina will not get eaten. Just, you know, if you have Steven, if you have Lyra, definitely use them. And just skip if you're done. Because you get more tickets or tokens. Here we go. So this is a relatively easy fight. If your Pokemon are not yet level 120, I suggest you do it now. It's very easy to unlock now and you can just unlock. No need to unlock, just level them up to level 100. Just play a bit of level state, you know, level up item stages, training area, the new training area. Level up your characters. I mean, it's not hard anymore, guys. So I just power up. I use Take Flight on Skyla to increase my defense, jump start, just do everything. You don't exactly have too hard. A you won't exactly have a hard time here. And now you can start attacking. Icy Wind. We have two. Recovery people, so no problem. You use um, sync move using price and just let the battle flow. Just use icy wind, you're pretty fast. You can actually use thunder shock to paralyze the opponent or ice beam to freeze the opponent now if you want to, but. This battle won't take too long to finish. You can just use potion, recover yourself. Ice beam if you want. Potion also on yourself. There it is, he's frozen. Now you're pretty safe now. Again, you sync move on price. And just attack using the others. And you should be done. That's it guys. Again, if you have Summer Steven or Summer Lyra. You can just use skip tickets. I just noticed that we can get a lot of skip tickets. I mean, I was asking why would you bother using skip tickets? Well, I kind of got the answer already. So, you know, just put Summer Steven in there. Just put, if you have Summer Steven, okay. If you have Summer Lyra, just put Summer Lyra in there. I don't, so I just put my Lyra in there. Where the heck is Lyra? And then, you know, just press ready. I don't have enough stamina. Then just use your skip tickets and you're done. So again, make ad take advantage of those multipliers at the bottom because you get more tickets by doing so. So that is it for me. I am trying to make a beginner friendly version for full force battle round one and round two. It's kind of tough. But I kind of already have an idea as to who I'm gonna use. So give this a thumbs up right now. And I'll see you in the next video. Right.